your daily news updates by the Shipping Tribune. Here we bring to you the latest maritime daily news in a short form video format. Please subscribe for regular updates. Indian Register of Shipping releases rules for construction and classification of Indian Naval Ships 2023. The Indian Register of Shipping's rules for construction and classification of Indian Naval Ships 2023 were released by the Honorable Raksha Rajya Mantri, Minister of State for Defence, Sri Ajay Bhatt, in presence of the Chief of Defence Staff, Chief of Naval Staff, Commanders in Chief, Principal Staff Officers, Senior Commanders on 4th September 2023, the opening day of the Naval Commanders Conference 2023 being held in New Delhi. The 2023 version of IRS Naval Rules incorporates the latest IMO IACS requirements as well as rule requirements for military design features. In addition, rule-related requirements for the technological advancements currently being incorporated in designs of naval ships, covering materials, structures, propulsion and other engineering systems, integrated electronics, safety systems, etc. have been included. Container shipping volumes to grow significantly in 2024. We forecast that global container volumes will grow by between minus 0.5% and 0.5% in 2023 and by between 3 and 4% in 2024. Combined headhaul and regional trade volumes are faring slightly better. We predict growth of between 0 and 1% in 2023 and between 3.5 and 4.5% in 2024. During the first half of 2023, the backhaul and regional trade lanes have performed slightly worse than we previously predicted. However, the headhaul trades have performed slightly better and total volumes did in fact match our last forecast in May. Panama Canal water levels at historic lows, restrictions to remain. The Panama Canal's water levels have not recovered enough as the end of the rainy season approaches and limits on daily transit and vessel draft will stay in place for the rest of the year and throughout 2024, the Waterways Authority said on Tuesday. The restrictions implemented earlier this year to conserve water amid prolonged drought triggered a backlog of ships waiting to pass the key global waterway, which handles an estimated 5% of world trade, contributing to more expensive freight costs ahead of the approaching Christmas season. Cape size uptick propels Baltic Index. The Baltic Exchange's main sea freight index rose on Wednesday, supported by gains in the Cape size segment. The overall index, which factors in rates for Cape size, Panamax, and Supermax shipping vessels, was up 18 points or 1.7% at 1081. The Cape size index rose 37 points or 3.7% to 1034. Average daily earnings for Cape size vessels, which typically transport 150,000 ton cargoes carrying commodities such as iron ore and coal, increased by $307 to $8,573. Thank you for watching the video. Please hit the like button if you like the video. Leave a comment down below and subscribe to the Shipping Tribune YouTube channel if you haven't already.